All right, let's look at solving this guy. This is still a linear equation, and what about it tells you that it's linear? <coughs> it's just x to the first power, right? Is there anything that's x squared or higher? There's nothing for us to worry about other than dealing with the linear equation. Now, you could do what we did before, and that is to get all of the x's on one side and constants on the other, but you could do something that'll help you out first. What is that? Get rid of the fractions. When we got rid of the fractions back in the day, we had to find and identify the what? The LCD. The LCD. So what is the LCD in this problem? 48. I think 24 will work, right? If I look between 8 and 6 on this side, you could say 8 times 6 is 48, but they have a common factor of 2, right? So you take that, that multiplication, that product, 48 divided by their common denominator, or their common factor of 2. 48 divided by 2 is 24, and you see that 24 still works. Well, 4 and 3 going to 24 as well? Then we are good to go here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply everybody times the 24. So if we look at it just like we did in the last problem, multiply both the left side and the right side times 24, <coughs> Now we just have to worry about simplifying this guy. So this is going to be, I'll make it easier for you, 24 over 1 <coughs> times 7 eighths x minus, this guy has to be multiplied times LCD as well. Do I need to say 24 over 1 or could I just say 24? <coughs> well, isn't 24 the same as 24 over 1? Mm -hmm. So it's still going to be the same, but I think a lot of times the students will do better when I see it as this improper fraction, 24 over 1. So we're going to keep on going down the line here, multiplying everything times 24 over 1. Now reduce this. Everything should simplify, excuse me, all of the denominators should simplify away if 24 truly is a common denominator. So how do things simplify here? The 8 reduces with the 24 to give me 3, so I get 21x, then what? <coughs> Minus 20 equals 4 reduces to give me 6, so I get 18 plus 3 reduces to give me 8. I get 40x. Do you all agree with that? All right, get x's on one side, constants on the other. Where do you want to move stuff? X is to the right, so if I move this guy over, what does he become? That's going to be a negative 21. That's how you're moving him over. So we end up with 19x. What about your constants? <coughs> Move it to the left, that's a negative 18, so you get a negative 38. And what does x equal? You do the reducing here, do the division. Negative 38 divided by 19 is negative 2. Well, that was almost too nice, wasn't it? Could you have worked this whole problem keeping all the fractions intact? Yes. But why? Why would you do that? Notice that as soon as I multiplied everything times 24 and reduced, I got a nice linear equation that was super easy to solve, and then I was done. Do you all agree? All right. Let me give you one more guy to consider. I should be able to give you an equation like this. 4x minus 6y is equal to 10. And I could say solve this guy for y. This is a formula. 
Well, it's, it's kind of with the discussion of formulas that we had back in 0308. You should be able to solve this for any specified variable. So if I say solve this for y, I want you to get y by itself. And what would you do? Move the x term over. So I have negative so it's y equals 6y equals what? Negative 4x plus 10. Negative 4x plus 10. Well, I've got my y term by itself, but I want just y by itself. How do I do that? Divide by 6. No. No? Negative 6. Divide everything by negative 6. Now, remember what you did <coughs> back in 0308. We would divide each of these pieces by negative 6. You could divide the whole right side by negative 6, but it means the same thing as doing this. And I wanted to have it separated like this so I could easily simplify it. So what does y equal when I reduce? <coughs> negative 2 thirds? No. Positive 2 thirds x. Minus 5 thirds. So we still have to know how to take equations that are linear and solve them for specified variables. <coughs>